Hey there everybody, my name is Total Dude. Welcome back to Motorstorm Pacific Rift. Hey there, sorry for the interruption so early on in the video. This is Total Dude during the editing process of making this video. I realized during the editing process that the title of this video might seem like clickbait. It's not. By the end of this video, you'll see that the AI is doing some pretty shady stuff. But for now, it's just going to be a pretty normal video up until you get around the end of it. So I just wanted to let you know and not leave you hanging there. Enjoy. We're going to continue the festival today. Starting off, of course, with the Earth Zone. With Mudslide Bogged Down. Oh, no. It's a match made in Motorstorm Heaven, though. We get to use a mud pointer. Now, you'll notice that this vehicle is actually different than it was before. That's because I started this video and chose this and then realized I didn't have microphone on the entire time, so I just scratched it. But don't worry, I didn't even get to start the race. I just, it loaded into the match and I immediately left <laughs> so that I could fix the microphone. I'll see you when the race starts. Okay. So yeah, I made it to right here before I had to leave. <laughs> Gives the microphone. Anyway, let's hit it here. See how it goes. All right. Got a nice hop there. That was about perfect. Uh oh. Well, that's unfortunate. Didn't stand up. <laughs> that school bus just owned me, dude. He's just like, he's like, you should have stayed dead, sir. I'm, ma I'm not making the cut this time. I'll just use one of these guys as a wall. Never mind, they're all going too slow. This guy isn't. There we go. Thanks for being a wall for me. <laughs> wow, I think that might be the fastest I've ever gotten through that top route right there. That was quick, dude. Okay, I figured that strategy out the other day, by the way, what I just did right there, with the, where you take a weirdish outside line, it's actually a little bit faster. At least it's more reliable. Uh-oh. Wow. I just got scooped. Man, there's a reason I didn't like this mud plugger, and I think I remembered what it was. I think it's just narrower than others. It's really easy to tip this thing. Okay. Let's do the hop here. Perfect. It's like, that's what that cut is supposed to look like right there. Okay. Make sure you go down. Don't flip. Gonna go down. really want to flip here too this thing is just tipsy man i got lucky right there but yeah you just hold the stick there and see how much quicker that is and trying to go like through the side oh well i'm just gonna throw that guy off my scent here or you know off of blocking me at least oh i'm really lucky to be alive 100 percent Okay, I stuck that one really well. Okay, as long as I get this cut, we're good. Can't see it, gonna do it blind. Ah, oh, I'm not gonna stick the landing, but I almost pulled that off. All right, this is gonna be close. I'm actually gonna stay up here, see if I can drop to the right. Like that, and that should put me in first temporarily. <laughs> oh man, dude, I should be dead right now. Not only because that semi truck barely missed me, 
but because I was tipping in the process. And by tipping, I lost just enough speed that the semi-truck missed me. So by almost failing, I saved my own life. <laughs> wow. Okay. What do we have in the Arizona today? Ooh, I forgot about that. It's the Badlands Speed Event. Cold Sweats. With an ATV. Alright. Alright, I'm using the Monarch Deerstalker. It's the only skin I got for it. It's this pink one. <laughs> so, here we go. Okay. 45 checkpoints this time. Ooh, I got a weird buddy hop. You know, it kind of worked, though. That was close. I gotta admit, though, ATVs are fast. Okay, I'm gonna touch this water. I'll lose a little bit of speed, but I'll gain some cooling on it because I overcooked the boost a little bit. I always thought it was weird that this track was in the air zone. Okay. Wow, I'm having to really focus here. Sorry for the lack of commentary. I like this ATV. It's actually one of my favorites. But again, it's still an ATV. And you guys notice I stuck those barrels in the way right there? Like, just blatantly stuck. Oh, no. Okay, just blatantly stuck barrels in the way of, like, where you're trying to go. Like that. I can't believe that counted. If I, did this, if I get this on the first try, I'm going to be really happy. Because I remember the first time I ever tried to do this, it took me forever to beat this speed event. But luckily, I have gotten used to the very squirrely wiggling of the ATVs in this game. Squirrely is a word. You can look it up. And... So... Plus, like I said before, this is one of the only tracks that you can get away with using an ATV effectively. Because it's just so wide. But they made it harder by dumping all these barrels everywhere. Wow, okay. What was that? I landed right on a barrel or something. I have no idea where I'm going after this. Well, that was it. Man, I just nailed that first try, dude. That <sighs> shows you how much better I've gotten with ATVs. That took me forever the first time I played that. Wow. All right. Man, we're really close to maxing out the rank there. I got 300 points left to win the game? I forgot that was a thing you could do. I'm not even going to get through all the tickets before I win this. I'll win the game, like, next video. Oh, that's so weird. But anyway, so we're going to go in here with a bike. What was the name of the ticket? It was The Rift Going Deep. Okay. Let's pick a bike. All right, I'm gonna use the Mohawk Roadhog. <laughs> Just why not? Get the double fuzzy dice on the front there. I love it. Let's do it. All right. <laughs> this thing always looks so weird. It's just so weird seeing like a man. That guy's really got this. Got the Wiggles going on up there, doesn't he? Must be his favorite band, the Wiggles. Favorite TV show as a kid, the Wiggles. <laughs> anyway yeah but i just thought it looked so weird seeing like a chopper style bike in a way it's, it's more like a cafe racer kind of deal if you really look at it like a bobber a bobber it's a bobber actually is what they call these kind of bikes and it's just funny seeing it with off-road like whole shot style tires <laughs> by the way whole shots work really well like in real life there's a reason they're so popular. The only problem is they don't last very long, especially if you get them on like a real hard surface like pavement or hard packed dirt. It rounds them off, then they don't work nearly as well.
Okay, that was a little weird, but... Wow, just got beaten on that one and lived. Okay, so we're gonna go to the right and then to the left. Perfect. <laughs> that's that's about just about perfect of what you want to do right there. Except right there, that was pretty bad. But up until that point, it was great. All right, let's take the secret tube. That nobody ever uses for good reason. One, it's really hard to get into. Two, it's slow. And three, it's hard to navigate, period. Whew. Yeah, see, see what I mean? <laughs> First to fit, just because I took that route. But it's cool that it's there. I appreciate them putting it in. Let's also do this. Man, I barely made that. I'm not going to make this... Okay, the water slowed me down enough. Wow, thank you for not running me over, sir. I very much appreciate that. If you could just get out of my way now, that'd be great. Thanks. Okay. I used to think this was the fastest way to do this. Exclusively. I take every vehicle through this route. And then I would do this. Do a weird hop. Yeah, like that right there. Perfect. That's exactly how I used to do it. And it is quick. But it's easier and slightly faster to take the water ruts if you're not worried about dying to all the monster trucks. Right. Left. Okay, so you slap the brakes right there a little bit. And yeah, then you stick like that. And man, that monster truck is scooting. Look at him go. Chill out on the boost because I'm already too late. At least I'll have it for later. Use just a little bit here to catch up so that I can do this. And I can outrun them. Beautiful. Oh, he's coming. I gotta watch him on this turn now. Ouch, it's so hard not. To have that not happen. Slap the brakes and everything, and it, it still have a go. Yeah, I do think this route is still slightly faster. You don't touch the water, that is. Or hit a tire. <laughs> Which I did both of. So, no, not so much, but. But he'll lose a lot of time right here. That route over those rocks is slower by all regards. Like, there's no way it's ever faster, even if you perfectly do it. Let's get the sticky landing. Should have, I should have this bagged right here. Oh, I got away without a brake slap right there. Those are rare. Hard to do. Nice. Clean sweep. Three-second lead over Mr. SUV. Great. On to the next one. Okay. On to the water zone. We have Beachcomber Tidal Takedown. This is an Eliminator race. And my choices are a bike or an ATV. This video is going to be short anyway. I'm flying through it, no problem. Let's use the ATV. It's on Beachcomber. Should work out fun. Okay, I'm going to use the Ibex Scout with the chain paint. Okay, what do we got? Am I gonna be like the smallest thing in here? Oh man. I should have gone with the bike. <laughs> Instant regret. All right, well, I'm gonna have to make this some real clean driving. Okay. Looking good so far. But as long as I stay up here and I front run, I think I can still pull this off. Which I, I have to front run. If I'm ever even remotely caught by anybody who can run me over, I am screwed. Royally.
Okay. All right, things are going all right. I'm never going to be able to look at those names up there because... Oh! I'm a, oh! Okay, that's how I say it. I lived through the log, though. I was just impressed by that. But... Gianti? I'm not sure how to pronounce that one. I don't recognize that name at all. Up for bait, though. I don't know who that one is. He's usually actually a pretty good racer. I'm surprised he's getting out this early. Something must have happened to him. Yeah, man. Good drivers are dropping like flies, Mr. SUV. Bob Foley, too. Man, dude. Just, I don't know. Bob Foley's kind of mid. Depending on what race and vehicle he's using. Oh man, Evelyn too. Man, these are some great racers, and they're they're dropping like flies. I'm gonna have a hard time catching this guy up here. Okay, Sandy Campbell. That's one I don't know. Man, I hate that turn, man. It's so hard to do. I'm, I'm screwed. Yeah. Well. Like I said, I wanted to make it interesting. This is going to be interesting, all right. Should have taken a bike. Okay. We'll do a bunny hop for fun. Uh oh. Well. Somebody clip that and put the wasted effect from GTA San Andreas on there. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, Bob's going out again. Yeah, see how it's the same. Bob's kind of mid usually. All right, we're doing better this time. Flame Boy, also kind of mid. A little bit. He's a little bit above me. He usually finishes like fourth. Ooh, I just heard this big rig good by me. Man, the Mr. SUV. I've seen him win a lot of races. Dimitri was taken out instead. Man, Dimitri's a good one. I would I would probably rank Dimitri above Mr. SUV. Really outside. Henry T. Pops. Alright. That's reasonable. Got a Patriot Minuteman in front of me here. I'm running the same situation I was in last race here. Kid Million. I've lost a couple races to him before. To Don't die. Okay. No! Don't drift. Okay. God, I hate ATVs. Did that guy die? No, I was a different guy. I was really hoping that was the person right here in front of me, because now I'm in the hot seat, like, immediately. I hope he takes the outside route. Wow. Oh, boy. I got 10 seconds to glory here. I'm not going to make it. Ain't going to happen. Nope. <laughs> he got me. Ah, man, that sucks. Let's try again.
Like I said, man, should have used the bike. Took everything but like a rank 7 race in an eliminator using an ATV on a track that does not really favor ATVs that well. To finally get a race to handicap me. <laughs> oh man. Made it farther than I thought, honestly. Or if something like this happened. But don't worry, we got a. I got one in the back of my mind here that I know is going to be worse than this. It was the last festival race I ever beat with gold. And it took me a, like a month, I think. The first time I ever did it. But we'll get there. We'll get there when we get there. Don't worry about it. I'll tell you about it when we get there. Where's the guy I'm first at? I mean, no way he's in front of me right now. I've been flying out through here like speed of light. Where is this mysterious man? Oh. Man, seriously, where the heck is that guy that's in first? Nice block, though. Okay, right here's the tricky part. Alright. Nice and clean. Ooh. This could be awkward landing. Yeah. Seriously, where the heck is that guy? Holy smokes, is that him clear up there? Oh my god, dude. That man is way up there. Somebody's got to put an end to his terror. Well, I ain't it. I'm, I'm out. There is no way I'm catching that dude in first. Unless he screws up to, like, horribly. I'm out. <laughs> unless he screws up horribly, though. Oh, no, he's right there. What just happened? Did he screw up terribly? Why am I flipping right there? Ah, I hate four-wheelers, man. The <laughs> worst. Worst vehicle in the game. Oh, well, I got to blow up. Worst vehicles in the game. By far. We're going to get this. With an ATV. Okay. Get more than you bargained for on this race, aren't you? Right, we're going to try the weird cut. Which is the outside, so that way... Yeah, I dodged him that time. I'm sliding all over the place, but it's working. So. All right. Okay. Oh! I don't know how I lived that long. I could see that death coming from 100 miles away, and that might have cost me the whole race right there. But luckily, everybody's still right here. God, man, ATVs are the worst. Get out of the way, dude. Okay, I actually hit the handbrake there intentionally because I was worried about doing that where I tip over. So it was actually a pretty clutch play. Okay. Do it here. Oh. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Oh, I am the hot seat, aren't I? Oh, man. <laughs> I'm alive. Not for long. Like, I was, and I'm going to die immediately. Oh, I almost made it, though. God, man, I hate four-wheelers. They're the worst. Oh, man. 
man. It's just they put the center of gravity of these things like so high. They don't ride like real four wheelers do. Real four wheelers are fun. I love riding those things. But like this in this game, dude, they just they don't make any sense. Wow, that's a bad start. But they don't make any sense whatsoever as to why they are that slidey. Like wow. I bet you I could get on a like a, just a bike though and beat this in like one or two tries. Like not a problem. But the four wheeler is so slidey and it tips over and dies for no reason so often. Like it's terrible. Okay, like I really tried to give me some rams there though, and I was just not having it. Don't get me wrong, this is a good track. It's just ATV suck. Like I got some crap, you know. Am I gonna get out in seventh place? Uh maybe. That was the sketchiest line ever, but it worked. <laughs> I'm making it happen, guys. I'm gonna make it happen. Why? It's like, why? Like, that's such crap. Oh man, I'm out. Yeah, I was dead either way. It wouldn't have mattered. This has got to be like the last rank seven race too. These guys are not rank seven. They're too aggressive for rank seven. I would imagine this is actually like, like right there. That guy came out of downtown to ruin my day right there. So, I'm going to assume that this is the last set of Rank 7 races. And that this is like the, the boss of Rank 7. <laughs> well, I'm in first right now. As long as I don't have some st something stupid happen to me. Like that. The race is just over from here. Because by the time I get this thing back up to speed, these guys are going to be so far ahead up there. I'll never catch the person that's in first. They all go too fast. Okay. I just gotta hope the person in first hits a tree or something. Which they probably won't. And... I can get lucky enough not to be smashed. Why do they always take out that building? What did the building ever do to you guys? <laughs> it's like... Yeah, that was clean. Wow, that was not. Okay, I'm going to catch these guys that'll buy me some more time. Please let the bridge be here. Okay, they didn't knock the bridge out. We stand a shot. The reason I slapped the bridge right there is I wanted to get a little farther outside the turn here. Because I have to catch this dude like now. This guy up here in the mud plugger. I gotta start trying to catch this guy like right now. Otherwise we're never gonna be able to do it. Okay, so he took the outside route. I did not get slapped into those trees, which that's that's huge, honestly. But I don't think I'm going to be able to catch that guy. Not with this vehicle. Okay, I'm saving up the boost here. Don't die. Okay. We're going to try the old slingshot strat. Well played, game. 
Well played. <sighs> if you didn't know what just happened, the guy that was in third used his death to screw me over so I couldn't win the race. I gotta admit, I can't even be mad. That was a good play. All right, we are absolutely flying. I'm gonna actually use the ramp to get a little bit farther. All right. Now for a brief second editing interruption. I'd like to point out that I'm currently in first place. I just got a slap landing on that turn back there and I'm pretty much going just about as fast as any vehicle in the game can go. Meaning, there should be absolutely no way for anybody to pass me. Yet, as soon as I go off that ramp just in front of me up there, the position counter will abruptly change to second place. When I land, there will be nobody in front of me. If you haven't noticed, this has actually been happening in this exact spot on multiple different attempts at this race since we started this particular ticket. Just pay attention to that over the next couple of races. Now we're using the ramp. We're not dying on the freaking crab pots again. God, I hate those crab pots. Okay. Okay, it's clean. We just gotta run really clean. Literal speed run for two laps. And I don't have to worry about the building being here. At least in the first lap, because there's nobody in front of me. I mean, it says there is, but there's not. The position thing is goofed up right there. There's no way there's a guy in front of me. Like, where is he? I've been in front this whole stinking time. You guys seeing this dude in first? Anywhere? Did they, did they just put a person in front of you that you just can't catch? There's no way that guy is that far ahead. That was a perfect run. You, literally, you can't beat that by speedrun strats. So, I, I question this. Did they just stick a person in front of me? The only thing I can think of is they did some impossible physics thing with the inside route where the plane is. See, now I went first again. Where'd that guy go? Like, where did he go? I mean, I'm dead, but... Like, I'm going to get out right here, but... But where did that guy go? Yeah, I'm out right here. There ain't no way. I'm alive, baby! That guy's going to be out of my way, too, but I'm not catching that ground first. Nope. <laughs> not a shot. I'm telling you, there's something. Something's up here. Something's up. Who is that guy? Okay, so we're going to watch for that car specifically. Where is he? We're going to take a... We're going to go... Oh, I can't do it right now. Hold on. Okay, now hold on. Let's go look at something. There we go. Okay, so he's right there. He is, in fact, in the race. How many cars are there? One, two, three. There's only 11 cars. There's eight there, nine, ten, eleven. There's not one to my right, is there? There's only eleven cars. Okay, no, but there's eleven positions. Okay. Okay. I'm going to pay very close attention here. I think something's up. Yeah, I don't know. yeah, we're just gonna bail that one. I ain't doing that. It's it's gotta be a perfect run. 
right here, so let's check it out then. Let's chase that guy around. Actually, I'm not going to chase him around. I'm going to get out in front. And we're going to rush. Okay, got him through. Toss him. I'm alive somehow. Normally that kills you. I just about got pit turned to oblivion right there, but I saved it. Bump me at the bottom, thanks. Okay. Where are these guys going? So now it makes sense. Okay, he took the left route. I just saw a guy over here. Is he breaking physics up here? Hold on, we're gonna try again. Okay, so we're gonna chase that guy around. If I can get over there. Hey, this guy right here? Actually, I'm... Oh, he's dead. Never mind. No, if that guy's in first, we know the game cheated. Okay. <laughs> because he just died. So... We're going to take the top route. i got to see what person's trying to break physics up here. Clean? Clean. Suddenly, there's nobody in front of me. Hmm. Oh, they're catching me, though. I can hear them back here. It's like the game couldn't cheat or something. Something's up. Something's up. There ain't no way a car's legitimately going that fast on that top route. Not an AI, at least. Because, like, we are absolutely flying. No mistakes whatsoever. Uh, this is going to be a mistake. Might be the end of the race right here, boys. I'm alive. It ain't pretty. But I should have enough of a lead to stick it. And I'm not looking back. That's just a death sentence. I'm just going to hope nobody comes after me. So I took the bottom route this time. And you notice I'm still in first. I We're going to try this one more time. Even if I win this race, we're going to go around the outside. We'll see what happens. No, nah, because like suddenly. Oh, is that him right there? Oh, he's coming. I was like, don't die right there. What a what a way to go that would have been. Okay, now we got it. We're going back in. <laughs> I'm not gonna complete the whole race. I want to see what happens if I go around that outside route. If I go around that outside route and I get a perfect run, are they just going to stick one of these turds in front of me? Because if you remember, this guy right here in front of me died. Which he did not do this time. So let's see what happens. Okay, so we're still in first right here. Like, not even questioned. We are in first. I'm going around the outside so I don't hit those freaking crab pots. All right, right there. Right there. Hold on. Did you see that? Is there somebody up there? There is nobody on the top route. Not a soul on the top route. Everybody else is really far behind me. And suddenly, somehow, 
there's a guy in front of me? I'm telling you, they straight up stuck somebody in front of me. Hold on. If there was somebody here, they would have to show up right there. I think they just straight up stuck somebody in front of you. Are you see what I'm saying here? Where is this guy? I don't see him anywhere. See, that guy's in third. Where is this dude in first? Okay, wait. Hold on. Okay, so we're intentionally going to throw this here a little bit. But give me a second. I've already won, so it's okay. So we're in second now? Okay. Now, stop. Right here. We have the green guy. Where is that dude who died at the very beginning of the race we won? Is he here? Nowhere to be seen. Hold on. We're just going to die. I'm okay with dying here. We're going to see who's in first. We got, I got to know where that guy is. Is he already dead? Or... I'll, I'll be back here in just a second. We'll see what happens. Okay, yeah. So here, here are like the last three people, right? There's two of them right next to each other that are legitimate. That guy that just blew up and the person in front of them are legitimate. They were there originally. If the person who wins this race is that guy, that guy, they straight up put that guy in first. And the only reason I won that race is because they didn't do it because he was dead. The game literally cheated, and I caught it red-handed. <laughs> That's pathetic. Man, dude, I'm, going, I'm doing so well, the game had to cheat to handicap me. Alright. <laughs> that makes me feel better about it. I don't need to do the bike anymore. I, I said I was going to use a bike on that race. I don't need to do it anymore. I now know why it was so hard. Anyway, the game literally cheated. Caught red-handed. Wow. Well, that's an eventful video. So, I think that'll be good enough. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Turtle Dude. Peace out.